Carl is back. What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Little Carl is back home from boot camp. He is living his best life. I feel like everyone is happy to see you. Are you happy seeing? Oh, thank you so much. So today we're talking all things summer. Before we jump into this, I really do want to acknowledge a couple of things. Please head over to my Instagram. At the very least, if you need someone to talk to, if you need a sounding board, if you need a little bit of light, hopefully this video can bring you that, but if you need resources, spots to donate, all of the things, my Instagram page as of right now, when I'm filming this is completely muted, but it's not, I feel very strongly about this. I literally did an IGTV video about this today. It's one thing to post up a square on your Instagram. It's a whole, and to disappear and say that you're muted. It's a whole other thing to continue the conversation. So I've highlighted all of the resources. I am actively in my DMs like more than I ever have, just having awesome conversations with you guys. And a lot of you needed to talk. So it's been fulfilling to say the least, very heartwarming. My cup is just overflowing. And I just, I love this community. I love you guys. and. I just, I wanted to honor that before we get started and just with, with the hope of nothing else, I hope that this video can just bring you a little bit of light in your day. Let's jump into this. I have a little mocktail here. Very refreshing mocktail. Some cherry bitters. I shared this in my nighttime routine. Some cherry bitters, some lime juice, some frozen wild blueberries, some coconut la croix, mm. and some almond orgeat syrup. It is everything and more. It is so good. You don't even know. Oh, and you can put some fresh mint leaves in there too. And I could have put a splash of kombucha. I think I should have. Okay, let's go get some kombucha. I will also show you guys what just arrived, which is gonna have its own full unboxing on my Instagram page. And it fully ties into summer. And then we will do, there's shopping bags all behind me in case you don't know. There's Indigo, there is Winners, which is basically like Home Sense and Home Goods, Michaels and Amazon. And we're gonna, we're gonna do all the things and we're gonna talk about all of the summer things. So. I'm going to quickly put some kombucha in here and I'm gonna show you guys some parcel that just came in that very much have to do with summer. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I actually have one of, oh my gosh, I'm propping you up on a candle right now. That is some creativity. Pineapple coconut kombucha, a little splash. So I actually have dinner in the crock pot going right now and in this oil burner right here, I have one of the pieces that came in today. So I just received one of the most beautiful parcels. And I did a full unboxing of full stories. It's all up on my stories right now on my Instagram, but you don't even understand. This is the most, not, not just summary, but most amazing parcel I have ever received. It is fully Disney inspired. So yes, the Disney videos are going to resume. I feel like we just need Disney in our lives right now. Disney is opening very soon. I'm super excited. I know people are going to Disney Springs. We have a trip planned for September. Let me know if you guys have rebooked your trips, what your plans are for your trips. Let me know down below. I'm so curious, but I'd, I really hope that we get to in September. But listen, listen, look at this. Tiki bar, tiki bars and tan lines. This literally smells like summer. And there is sunsets. Listen, it gets better. There is golden pineapple Dole Whip. So these are like, either sugar scrubs, um, shaving whipped butter. There's also bubble, what does she call them again? Bubble bars. Listen, you don't even know what I'm about to show you. Flying over the orange grove. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. There's a gray stuff. Mm -hmm. This one, I, I, I cried at this collection. This, okay, I often get asked, what's you and Andre's next big goal after the house? That's our goal. If you can read that, that's our goal. That's the next big goal. So there's a full, she has a full Club 33 collection. So this one is a shaving soap and we're literally gonna display it. And then she's got like, look at these little soap bars, Mickey waffles. It just keeps going and it all smells amazing. There's seasonal things, there's bath bombs. So look at the seasonal, like I am ready for Halloween. We're ready for our Halloween videos, poison apple. Oh, you don't even know. I think one of my favorites is the hair oil. Tea and cakes. So everything is Disney inspired. It is happy. It is festive. It is a great product. I love it. I have a discount code for this down below. Support small businesses right now. I make nothing off of the discount code. I hope that you guys know that. It's literally just the generosity of the business owner to share that with you guys. So it's Angie15 if you guys want a discount code. And it is, I want to get it right. It is Confectionery Soaps Co. Look at this. I'm amazing. I'm blown away. The idea for the bar cart, I usually start with bar cart this tray area right here i'll spin you guys around so you can see what i'm talking about this like tray area right here i'm gonna put some stuff in there 
and then my coffee tiered tray. That's usually where I start and then I kind of disperse from there. And that kind of fills up the theme for the house, especially when it's not Christmas and we fill the entire house with decorations because that's just on a whole other level. I made more room for decorations just so everyone here knows. I installed shelves in the garage. If you haven't seen my garage deep clean with me, we have room. I have, I have freed up some space. We are ready for another season of decorations. All right, let's jump into this. So the theme of, I have no rhyme or reason in the order I'm gonna go, but the theme of the summer that I'm going for was inspired by one Ray Dunn mug that I got when we were in Florida right before Remember that time I got kicked off an airplane? We can laugh about it now, it's fine. I didn't do anything wrong, but I, we drove home. So right before that day, I think at TJ Maxx, I got a Create Your Own Sunshine, the Ray Dunn mug, and it's so cute and it has yellow inside. And I thought, well, that's what I wanna do. I wanna do like yellow, lemon, honey, sunshine, like that's gonna, so yellow is gonna be the theme with like a touch of blue and very like lemon Santorini that's in that's inside my noggin the vibe i'm going for and we're going to do a full decorate with me but right now can we just talk about the stuff i got so this was one of those purchases where andre was in line and i was like one second i see something and it was like the cutest this is a little candle i don't think i'm gonna light it so it's a soy candle it wasn't about the smell i don't even know what the smell is oh vanilla but i just thought it was so pretty like very spring they had pink and purple um indigo is kind of like Barnes and Noble. Oh my goodness, you're back with all of your sniffings through all of the things. Indigo's kind of like Barnes and Noble, but dare I say better. It's a Canadian owned company, but they ship everywhere. So I will link everything that I have down for down below for you guys. Um, oh, this is very spring and very summer. I can't grow a plant to save my life. So I bought this. It's called Bloom and it's nutrients for indoor plants. It's organics based fruiting and flowering formula. Now this could be total BS and I just fell for it. I do not know. I think I, I paid, oh no, I, I wasn't that bad, $14.99. And the candle was, I don't know. It was one of those purchases of the cash that I just was like, I need to have it. So I have, don't lick that. Carl, what are you doing? Then this totally fits the theme of like the summer this was $29, Seashore Breeze. I'm pretty sure everything had like an overall blanket sale on it though. And in store, by the way, super chill. Everybody was really cool. Um, it was a pleasant shopping experience. It wasn't stressful. There are some stores where I just wanna say like they're not managing it well at all and it's more stressful for the shopper than it should be. And there are other stores that are just amazing. Very pleasant to be around, very incredible. So this is what Carl's face is in all the bags. I don't know if you guys can see. What are you doing? The best ever was Carl digging through the bags. I think it was at Christmas. If you guys remember that home goods haul, that was freaking hilarious. That was so funny. So this was the reason for getting the bloom stuff, this yellow. So I am going with yellow and this is an indoor garden. I don't know what's in here. Oh, oh, I didn't read it out. Dwarf sunflowers. That's gonna be so cute. So there was like a pink one and a blue one with all different options that's gonna be so cute carl we can do this we've got this we're gonna plant some things we're gonna find our green thumb now one of the other things oh this is in the mail okay so i bought a full collection of this little can you see how there's lemons on here so i got four tumbler mugs that have the same print on them with the lemon so i'm going to put four tumbler mugs up there for the decorate with me so you guys will see more stuff and then there's a big salad bowl coming in this same like acrylic summery like outdoor type stuff i just figured it'd be really cute to like store the salad bowl there with the spoons in it and just grab it for if we're eating on the patio and whatnot by the way i'm totally redoing our entire back patio i have so much to share with you guys I'm like an open book. I'm too much of an open book sometimes. Our entire lot next to us with the pool is gone. It's just a it's just a mound of dirt. So Angie had to find something to do in a pool. Like I needed a pool. I can't just not have a pool. So I bought a kitty pool, but it's like an adult kitty pool and it's pretty epic. Andre thinks I'm crazy. I'm trying to move up to to a soft tub. If you have a soft tub, comment down below and let me know. But I want I'm completely revamping this whole back balcony because we've never used it. So we have the three three season room. It's a one season room, but the screened in porch downstairs that we love. And I wanted to kind of create an atmosphere up here, which is basically just cocktailing. I don't know what else to call it. So I got some lounge chairs. I have an umbrella coming, a ton of stuff. I have some pillows I'm gonna show you guys, amazing. But that's gonna be a whole other video. In terms of decor, I wanted to do a couple of cocktail books. So I went in the sales section and I found these, which I thought were perfect. Like how cute, 
So this one is, does it say gin inspiration? Andre loves gin and it has like the lemons on it. One second, it has the lemons on it. So cute. And then craft cocktails, Miami cocktails. You know, you know, we're Floridians at heart. So I just thought on the bar cart like that, very cute pop of yellow. And then this was in the sales section also. See, $10. And it just says citrus recipes that celebrate the sour and the sweet. I thought that was very cute and very on point. That's what I do, by the way, tip for decor. I just go into the sales section. <laughs> what do you want? I just go into the sales section for the books and I pick from those since honestly, they're not for reading. They're more for decor. Will I read them more than likely? Yes. You're a part of it. And then the last one of the last things that I got at Indigo, like I said, the other stuff is on order and it's coming but I got this. Andre took a part of display for me. I thought this was so pretty. I just got one and it's gonna sit right in the middle here. Hopefully it fits, yeah. It's gonna sit right in the middle tier there and have the bowl on it. I think that's the plan. All right, moving on. I went to Winners today. Okay, I shared this on my stories and in my nighttime routine, we went to Marshalls and we were the first people in the store. We were the only and first people in the store. It was so pleasant. It was supposed to be a rewards members only right after a uh, employees only event, but nobody was there because they're at the back of this strip mall outside and the strip mall isn't really open yet where we are. So I was the first one in the store and the guy was so nice. He's like, come in, it's fine, come in. And I was like, and the store was so clean. It was incredible. So I got a couple things, but today I went to Winners, which I don't know if you have Winners where you are. It's kind of like Home Sense and Home Goods. It was great. It was great. So my best friend already bought me one of these and it's waiting at her house, but I couldn't wait. So I got this notebook because you can never have too many. But then there's a story here. So she, my best friend also got me, she's a Dun Hunter for me. She's on it. So she got me Busy Bee, which is super rare if there's the yellow inside. They had that one when I was there, but they also had, isn't this so cute and it has yellow inside. This was $6.99 Canadian, don't forget. Ray Dunn, amazing. So it's gonna be like summer, Ray Dunn, honey, be kind. Oh, so hers says busy and then there's a bee, like busy bee. Oh, that was cute. So she's bringing that over. And then I also got this little plant that is very Angie and Andre. I love it. This is $9.99. And I heard that they're starting to replenish the stores as of next week. Like apparently the, st the stuff that's in stock is still from before the stores closed. And the stuff is insanely discount. Some of the stuff, not this, but the stuff I got at Marshall's was like 70 cents. It was insane. Then I got more Ray Dunn pens. I got Take Note, Doodle, and Brainstorm. I had Valentine's Day ones like this. So this was $9.99. Way cheaper whenever we buy stuff in Florida, but it's all good. Okay, let's keep going. Again, no rhyme or reason. Oh, I'm, just, I'm gonna decorate with these. I don't really use them to eat because I don't want to put them in the dishwasher because they'll get ruined, but so summery. I've shared these during my Easter haul because I did my Easter haul so early for spring. <laughs> I did in like February. Thank God though, because we wouldn't have had anything. So look at how well, I'm just gonna show you the yellow one. Okay, so there's little Mickey sprinkles in here and then on the spoon itself, there is a Mickey, like an, em, an embellishment of little Mickey. So I got four of them and I'm just gonna stick them in a mug. I feel like that's gonna be really cute. All right, this came in today from Amazon. So we're switching to Amazon, I guess. We're gonna be all over the place. These came in a pack of three and I thought they'd be perfect for coffee tray, tiered tray, little succulents, but they're very spring. I just got green, but they had multicolored also. Or even for outside. Oh, looks like a little Chia Pet. I thought it was really cute. So if you put them like all in line together even, I thought it was cute and it was very reasonable. I think it was like less than $20. Again, I will link it. And then this one. So they're all, all three are different. I can't hold all three up. I'm not a magician, but <laughs> let's continue. Okay. Oh my gosh. I don't know what's in here, but it sounds very breakable. Oh, this was also, this was from Marshall's. Don't break anything. Don't break anything. Okay. Andre actually picked this up for me at Marshall's. So lemon, he was like, don't you need a lemon? I'm gonna, I'm gonna make you guys love my husband. He's like, don't you need a lemon dish towel for your decor for your lemon theme on the end of the bar card? I'm like, these are the reasons I married you. Amazing. So he got me a pack of four. Lemon will go on it and then the other three I'll just use in the kitchen. 
They're all like yellow themed, very cute. This goes with the other books. This is a book I already had, but you can still get it. It's a Negroni book. This is Andre's favorite cocktail. Very Italian, very Amalfi Coast, very Capri, fits in with the theme. So this is gonna go on the bar cart as well. And I don't even wanna show you guys this because I don't think it exists anymore, but I'm gonna use this to decorate. It's on the bar cart back there. So I have an absinthe one. I have, there's a couple different ones, but this is a gin and tonic candle. They might still sell versions of this at Bath and Body Works. It smells pretty good actually. So they're, they were just like cocktail inspired. I thought it was super cute. Then this, I top on Amazon customer service, but I got a little honey pot and there's gonna be like a little honey, I think it's called a honey dipper. It didn't arrive with it. So they're sending me a second one, which is fine. And this is gonna go on the tiered coffee tray. So there's like a little bee on there. So imagine this with this. Cute, right? If you guys can hear heavy breathing, Andre is doing his workout downstairs, not to worry, no one's dying. Moving on, and then I'm gonna go and show you guys back there exactly what's already on the bar cart. I've just kind of been accumulating it back there. These glasses, guys, I get a lot of my cocktail glasses from FabFitFun. Now, I have not opened this, let's pray that it's in one, in one piece. So these were from FabFitFun that I got them, and that's where I get my fishbowl glasses. Oh, my cocktail is still in the kitchen but the brand, Chic and Tonic, same brand as the fishbowl glasses. Okay, so pretty, oh my gosh, so pretty. So these I feel are perfect for like mocktails, margaritas, whatever. So can you see the, oh, I hope you can. Yeah, you can see like the honeycomb detail on there. Fits perfectly, so I have four of them. Again, not a magician, can't hold up four, but you guys get the idea. Um, those are by Chic and Tonic, got them like super discounted from FabFitFun. And then I'm going to put these. So I got these little lemon wedges off of Amazon. There is a bunch of them, 12. I'm gonna put one in each of the cups. So that's gonna be super cute. And then let's jump, let's jump into Michael's. So this is from Michael's and this canister, what would you, like aluminum canister, galvanized canister. I thought this was super cute. Little rope decor ball, which might go on the coffee table in the living room, but it all kind of fits within that like coastal vibey theme. Okay. Then I got, I, by the way, Michael's delivery service has stepped up their game. At least in Canada, they have maybe in the States. It was always amazing, but it's like a one day delivery. You might get everything in an individual parcel, but it's wonderful. So I got some lemon branches. So these are gonna go on the top of the bar cart and probably stuck in this galvanized tin. Maybe I also have a separate plan. Aren't these beautiful? These are from Michael's. They're individual and then, so the big boys are individual and this was one. And they were like 40% off. Aren't these gorgeous? These are gonna go somewhere fabulous in our house. I'm thinking even maybe the master washroom or something. I love those. That's all Michael's. What is in here? Oh, that's why it's so badly wrapped. I had to wrap it myself. <laughs> This is a giant mason jar. This is what I think I'm gonna put the lemon branches in and put it at the top. I thought it was very, um, I don't know, it fit the theme, I like it. And then I got this tiny little plant for the tiered tray, cause it's little, little. Where are you going? Kyle just ran by. Okay, that's one Michaels. And then this is the second Michaels. Oh, don't even with me. This was, okay, I don't know if this is just Canadian. I hope that you guys have it in the States. The reason why I'm saying that is it's part of the Canada Day collection. But listen, they must have like a 4th of July collection. I don't know, 4th of July, I don't know. But the, we had like a red one and a white one. It's a we call them Muskoka chairs. I'm sure that's not what you call it in America, but we call it a Muskoka chair. Do not ask me where this is gonna go. I truly have no idea, but it is amazing. And that's all that matters. This haul is gonna be a really long video. I hope you guys are enjoying it. If you guys are still here, I appreciate you. Okay, next. So I have this like wooden thing right here on this console and I wanted to put some, like a floral something or I don't know. So I saw this, which is definitely an option to put there. So it's like, like a four piece little vase and then I got four of these little yellow, summer yellow, summer green. I don't know, I'm gonna work with it, but this is kind of the vision that I have. And again, I'm trying to tie in the yellow without being too like obvious about it. And I'm gonna have to work at this, but that's the vision that I have. That's cute, right? Oh, is that cute? I don't know. It'll be cute. We're gonna make it cute. 
you're gonna be cute. Listen, we're gonna figure it out. And then I found this, which was very farmhouse and also yellow and the vibe that I'm going for. So this I was also thinking could go. Maybe that's better, right? That may be better. You know what, we're gonna work through it together. You guys are gonna be a part of it all. Do I have anything else in here? No, okay, that was Michael's. And then, oh, oh, he is from, where are you from, friend? This is from the drugstore. This is from Shoppers Drug Mart, which is our drugstore. It's a giant lemon dispenser. Did I need this? No. Will it make my life better? Yes. So we got it. I don't know how I'm gonna display this, but it's definitely gonna go up there. And then one thing, just to show you guys the plan for the outside. I thought these were beautiful. So these are pillow shams for that outside. Like this is gonna be a part of the whole outdoor video, but I got these like boho style pillow covers and I already have the pillow. Oh my God, they have tassels. And they were, they were like dirty cheap. So these are to put, I got two lounge chairs that are still on their way. Thank you Wayfair for taking forever. Does it ever happen to you guys that you order something, it's guaranteed by a certain date. And then they're like, oh, due to unforeseen circumstances, we're gonna delay your delivery by two weeks. Sorry, don't worry, bro. It's, it's summer only lasts like one week in Canada, but it's all good. So these are the pillows and they're like, I just love them. So I got two of these. The whole theme outside is very beige and white. And then these are, I think they're called Turkish towels. Yeah, so I got like these striped fringe towels and then the umbrella outside has a fringe and is this color. It's gonna be phenomenal. You aren't even ready. It's gonna be phenomenal. So that's what's going on there. And I'm gonna show you guys just a couple of ideas that I have for the bar cart that I feel are really affordable and really cool summer decor. I hate the way I say decor. It's because I'm French. I say like, I say certain words. Carl, what are you doing? Carl, I see you back there. What are you doing, little friend? You guys can follow Carl on Instagram, by the way. If you have any questions about Carl, it's all answered on his Instagram page as well as the video that I made of him. All right, did I need this many lemon straws? Probably not, but will we use them? Yes. So these are paper straws, which we all need, and I'm gonna use them as decoration, but I'm also gonna use them in my drinks. So I got these like, <laughs> that's a lot of straws. So I got those from Amazon. And then in terms of decoration, I got a two pack of this product of Italy, Limmy, lemon juice. I just thought that's like really the vibe I'm going for. So lemon juice, and then I got some Limonata San Pellegrino. These are those candles I was talking about, mint julep and smoked absinthe. The big chic and tonic fishbowl glasses are back there. I'm obsessed with these glasses. I'll link them. If they come back in stock, I will make sure to announce it like crazy on my Instagram. And then I'm also decorating with these. So these are like sparkling waters. So there's a Mandarin one, Portofino, and then I have another one, Limonata up here, I'll show you. And I love the packaging on it, like the striped. You can just get this at the grocery store. I got it off of Amazon, but it arrived in a million pieces. So, but Amazon's super good with customer service. Now, the whole inspiration for the entire bar cart was from this. This is a gin that I bought from, for Andre called Malfi, and I just thought it was so beautiful. So that's, it, it almost looks like lemon circles that are in there, so that's gonna be one of the main focus points. I got these little lemons. They're just little salt and pepper shakers. These are actually from Italy, from our trip to Italy. By the way, I'm listening. The Greece video will be up soon on that. I'm thinking of like European trips. And then I got this little lemon from Amazon. Did I think it was gonna be bigger? Yes, if I'm being honest. What else? And then I have some fake lemons in here. And then everything else is really gonna get pulled off and cleaned up, but these are the little, I just think it's cool to decorate with like some little lemonade bottles. I think it's sparkling lemonade. Yeah, sparkling lemon, spe sparkling lemon beverage. So that's what's going on with the bar cart. He's gonna go, you need, you're too negative, you need to go. But yeah, we're decorating all outside. <laughs> I'll give you a little sneak peek. I'm literally gonna do this today because it's so nice out. There's part of the pool. There's one of the tables that I bought to go outside and there's my inflator. And I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys what the backyard looks like. You wanna come outside, bro? All right, that's better. So right now the balcony has nothing on it except for our barbecue, which is right behind me. So there's quite a bit of space up here. So I'm thinking I'm gonna put the pool right here and then both loungers are gonna come out here. We'll see. But this is where the pool was. Hi, God. Hi, buddy, it's okay. I really hope you guys saw that. We have foxes. I really hope you guys saw that. They're so beautiful. We have six foxes. He didn't even, he didn't even realize that I was out here. Hi. Oh, I wanna pet one. I love them. So we have 
two parents and four babies that live around here and their house used to be under here so this is where the pool was we sold the lot so we're moving we're moving on hence why we have the house in florida and this whole backyard area we're going to landscape as well we're actually piped in for a fireplace outside we might do that i'm not sure where, what are you doing back there buddy can you see him what are you doing come on so yeah that's the plan and we're also building some really nice privacy screens up here so that's just a little bit more private so we have plans things are happening big things are happening you coming in carl so i hope you guys enjoyed the extra long decoration hall summer vibes all the things all of the the goodies i will link everything that i talked about for every reason for whatever reason i ever miss anything just tag me down below let me know that i missed it i will share the recipe for the cocktail you can also go check out my nighttime routine and with that said make sure that you are subscribed make sure that you're following on instagram so you don't miss any stories give this video a thumbs up if you guys liked it and i will see you guys very soon bye dudes.